Natasha, thank you. This morning, Connecticut continues to remember the life of former U.S. Senator Joe Lieberman. He spent years serving mm. Connecticut in the legislature as Attorney General and U.S. Senator, and that was before he burst onto the national stage. News aides Ken Pierce live in our newsroom this morning with a look back. Good morning, Ken. Laura and Keith, good morning to you. It's a testament to Joe Lieberman that even political opponents remained friends with him. Democrats and Republicans held the senator in high esteem. You may remember Ned Lamont ran against Lieberman in 2006. Lamont won the primary. Lieberman won the general election. It was hotly contested. But yesterday, Lamont said the two stayed in touch as friends afterwards. Attorney General William Tong said he wouldn't be AG if not for Lieberman's encouragement. Remember, Lieberman spent 10 years in the state Senate and then six years as state attorney general before his four terms in the U.S. Senate. And then, of course, Lieberman came just a few hundred Florida votes short of becoming the first Jewish vice president in U.S. history. He was a person of faith. He was someone that prayed regularly. Um, he um, went to synagogue every week. He, he read the Old Testament. He was very grounded in his faith and was very calm. And if you've ever been at the Capitol, either down in Washington or in Hartford, you know that calmness and serenity is not what you see, but that's what he emanated. But the greatest testament to Joe Lieberman might be that eight years after he was the Democratic vice presidential candidate, there was real talk about him being, being John McCain's running mate in the Republican Party. So people on both sides of the aisle certainly admired him. I had the privilege of talking to him many times over the years, and he was calm, as the lieutenant governor said, but he was also funny and smart and really just a nice guy. Live in the newsroom, I'm Kent Pierce. Laura, back to you. Kent, thanks for that. And this is a developing story that we'll continue to follow for you. Be sure to stay with News 8 for the latest updates.